Hello everybody, this is Aqua Tammy, and we are back today with The Sims 2 Mega Hood. This is round number 6, part number 91. Okay, we're almost done with round 6. We got one more house after this. And we're with the Frost family downtown. It should be a Saturday. Okay. Now, the Frost family is Ellen Frost, straight out of college. She is a fortune sim. She wants to be the chief of staff. She is an Aries. She's not the nicest of people. She is in love with Tybalt Cap. And she currently wants to flirt with Tybalt. High bought cap. Anyway, she also wants to marry a rich Sim and earn five thousand dollars. And I do not believe she has anything except for being a fortune Sim. What do you have in your pocket? You have some expensive furniture in your pocket. What if we um, sell that for some monies? Because you're going to be in debt in just, you know, half a second. Oh, she did woohoo with Dawn. Oh, right. She woohooed Dawn. And she's woohooed Tybalt. And she woohooed Chaz. So she started with Chaz, got caught cheating by Chaz when she woohooed Tybalt. And then lately she has woohooed Dawn Lothario. So she's had three woohoos. Okay. I was going to do something, and now I don't remember. Oh, right, her turn-ons. She's turned on by hard workers who like mechanical but don't like cleaning. Huh. All right. All right. All right. Very good. We're being brought a, um, a nice computer, which we will use to help pay bills. We are going to bank online, loan... 10,000 bank online loan 10,000 um and see if we can get all these plants plant loans bought out Her house has got a black and white thing going on. I don't know why, but it does. I put them in their houses a long time ago. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, that's not bad. You've got $9,000, so we can pay that loan way down. Um, so let's pay your loan. Um, let's pay 5000 on it. That'll get it down to fifteen. And then let's pay another three thousand on it. Okay. Let's turn on all your lights. All right. Now let's find you a job. You want to be in the medical field, <clears throat> so we will see what we can do. Journalism? No. <clears throat> no to journalism. Dance again? Uh, no. Even though you would start on level three. Athlete? Mm -mm. Not for you. Actually, it could be for you. Artist? Mm -mm. Could be for you, but it is not your lifetime wish. And paranormal? No. Nope. Career. Uh, medicine. You're going to start level one. All right. That's what you want, though. So, you have what you need. And you work tomorrow at 8 a.m. Okay. I 
I'm amazed she hasn't called Tybalt straight away for a beauty call because that's what's been going on in every house I've played this morning. First thing they do, booty call. But she's like, no, let me read the paper. That's cool. So this is the house. Got like a galley kitchen, a little bit dining area, a little bit of a living area, and only one bedroom. So this is definitely a starter. These are the kind of starters I don't like. I have a philosophy that a starter home has to have two bedrooms. If it doesn't, what are you doing? Because then the your starting Sam suddenly gets pregnant. Where do they put the baby? You know? So I like two bedroom starters. This is a good for single folk, but not good for anybody who has a family. I'm sorry, Nancy Graham, Tasha Go, but I'm not greeting a teenager. That's not that's not something I'm doing. What is your hobby? Music and dance. Okay. Well, we could greet Matthew. Matthew the cheater. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be so hard on him. I mean, but but it just, I don't know. For some reason, I didn't expect him to cheat. And when he did, it caught me off guard. You're getting hungry. You do have some food. Cheese, <laughs> you bought all dessert. Um, you bought all dessert. Loading flower hydrant. You're gonna try to bust a move. I'm not sure he's gonna go for that. This is funny because aren't these two in a relationship? Oh, she hates Chaz. She likes Phineas, okay. She likes Don okay. She likes Tom okay. Just waiting to see if we were going to get a. Uh, at least let her chat with you. She invites you into our house and you're going to be rude to her? What is she doing? Bragging? I don't know. It worked. Oh. It worked, so that's fine. Oh, now she's going to be rude. Tell me that he is not here with the welcome wagon again. Sid, what are you doing with your life? I don't see a welcome wagon, though. Yep, here they come. Great, Sid. Great, everyone. We keep getting the same people for our welcome wagon. I don't know what determines the welcome wagon. There's not any pregnant people on the lot, right? Okay. I could do some some cheesecake. And I don't want necessarily want Oh, she's talking though. We'll let her talk. Uh, did you talk and have a good time? Oh, she's attracted to Jason. I'm just going to throw that back in her pocket until she decides that she's through talking. And then we'll feed her. 
Sid comes to every one of these. It's always Sid or... We need to great Natasha. I know you were getting on with Jason. And Jason, you know, he's available. Toss football, huh? They're just gonna watch some TV. That's fine. Oh, her neck. Does that not hurt your neck doing that? Oh, wow. Y'all gonna play Kiki Bag again? Oh. These two like to play Kiki Bag. the teenager. No, thank you. I think we should just serve the food. And there's no, no one coming at the moment. And I don't think anyone here is pregnant. So I think we're good. No, nobody here is pregnant. So we should be good. And again with the teenager. Mm, I could go for some cheesecake. I didn't buy cheesecake. I bought some brownies though. They were really good. I wasn't wanting brownies. You put them in the microwave for like 10 seconds and then you eat them with a fork. It's really good. don't like her? What what was that about? If you don't like her, you can go home, Lisa. Nobody said you had to be here. Investing increases your family funds by $48. Okay. Oh, have I done her thing yet? Okay, I did. Okay. They're not actually playing. They're actually just standing... What is this about where she keeps doing the no with the thing over her head? Hold on. Don't go. Almerick, don't go anywhere. We're going to grate you. Come on, Almerick. Almerick, don't go anywhere. I really am trying to come grate you. But people are just... People are being crazy in my house. Do I know you? Well, I know you now. Here's uh, Patrick King. You want to greet him? I mean, he's not playable, but...
She's bored. You want to go invite Tybalt over? I mean, you haven't. You actually haven't did a booty call today. Much to my surprise. I guess we're going to put the food up so it doesn't go bad. going to be the call to invite us downtown because that's the way these things go. Whoa. Oh, it's time vault. Oh, but... But I'm here with a house full of people, Ty Bolt. I can't go downtown. Full of people, Tybal. You come here, dude. Can you use the bathroom? I can't just leave a house full of people and go downtown. I mean, I could, but that seems irresponsible. Lola. Lola. Don't be like that, Lola. I only have so much patience with you, Lola. Lola Loner. Mortimer. Hey, Morty. Should we put the food back out? Maybe we should. There's not much there, but there's a little bit. Alright, bye Lisa. She wasn't happy the whole time she was here, so... Funny that you just walked by when your wife just got here. AJ, don't give me grief. Um, you just met his wife. AJ! Well, she is meeting people. She 
Just getting a little hungry again. We've got we've got another dish we could serve. Does she know how to cook? Not really. Let her finish this conversation she's having. Come clean up a little bit. Well, you want to marry a rich Sam. He's a rich Sam. Maybe you should get to know him. She is turned off by him. She'd rather marry Tybalt. But... Hmm... But time won't... Now, please don't set yourself on fire. Do you have a fire alarm? Uh, okay, you have a smoke alarm. Do we have a... Do we have a burglar alarm? I'm going to assume we don't. Please don't set yourself on fire. Yeah, impressive. Dude, there's food right in front of you. I haven't been fed. I need to leave. Well, you know what? Bye. That's why I put food out for people. I can't make you eat it. Or this call, whatever the hell it is. <laughs> are those black or are those blue? You know, they kind of look blue and black. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, a professor has called you? Uh, honey, you don't need to be talking to a professor. Those days are over. Just just say no. Is anybody else going to eat? Why don't you go take a shower? And it is midnight. So we'll just put the rest of the food up. They didn't eat when they had a chance. That's their problem. Uh, people, get out of my bathroom. Out of my bathroom. And then I'll clean up this plate. Mm. 
Oh, yeah, you wouldn't be attracted to him because you like hard workers. He's retired, and you don't like people good at cleaning, and he is good at cleaning, I think. I think. So, yeah, it's no wonder you don't like him. We've gone this whole episode without a booty call. It is, it is strange. Ellen just broke the mold. I'm just gonna look out the window. Okay, hon. Alright. You want to, we can just say it, goodbye to everybody. And send them all home when you can go to bed. We'll talk. <coughs> Sorry about that. Try not to cough in the microphone. <sighs> She's got work at eight o'clock in six hours. We gotta say goodbye to everybody. Yeah, everybody's leaving. Say goodbye to everyone. And then you can go to bed. And not a single booty call. That is very surprising. Oh well. Well that is it for this one. Thank you so very much for watching my video. Bye for now.